this is what I eat in a day. I had to show my mom what I'm eating because she's always asking, are you eating? Are you eating healthy? So here you go. Also, I do the same to my kids, so yeah. Welcome back, my name is Catherine, and on this channel, I talk all things business, mom life, and everything in between. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe, and let's get to it. First of all, we're gonna start with breakfast. Breakfast is my favorite meal. I get to start off my day right. I try to eat something healthy that doesn't make me feel sick. So we're starting by getting all the ingredients. So I need avocado, eggs, a knife, and of course the bagels. So I cook my eggs with olive oil. It's one of the healthier oils. And then we're going to cut this avocado. That was very difficult, by the way. Then we get into the bagels. I need to eat gluten-free things. Bagels are gluten-free and vegan, so they're super healthy. The only thing I don't like about these ones is that they have soy in them. I'm looking for a different variety, so if you know a different variety of bagels that have soya, then please let me know. Put the avocado up now because I need to put this. This one's very overripe, so it's gonna be interesting to put this on my toast. You'll just see in a minute. Now we're gonna just put it all together. So you see me putting the layers on. As you can see, the avocado is not the greatest to spread, but you know, we do what we do. Putting it all together and it looks delicious and I'm so excited to dig into this. A wee bit of salt because we need that salt, but not too much. And then I need to get my coffee. Girl's gotta have her coffee. Okay, so we're just doing this thing. I'm not the greatest at Beaumart, so don't expect anything exciting. I always give Don a bit of my banana because he's the cutest thing on earth. Look at him go. Oh my goodness. I gotta drink my water because I'll start my day off right. Chug chug. So then we're into lunchtime. So I got some of these little shrimps. I'm gonna try this out this time. I need garlic in my life, so I gotta crush, crush, crush. Peeling it all off and getting ready for my meal. So this is going in with the shrimp because I just wanna try and like give it a little bit of flavor. We're gonna stir that up and let it cook. Meanwhile, we're gonna chop up all the veggies because gotta get the veggies ready. And then also rice, because I want to put the rice in with the rice wrap. Yes, this is red cabbage. It's one of my favorites put in the rice wraps. That and some green onion, it gives it a little light flavor of onion. And then of course carrot, because the carrot just gives it a little bit more of a crunch. Look at those beautiful colors, yay! Okay, so then we're gonna make the sauce. It's some chili garlic sauce with obviously soy sauce. We're gonna mix it all together. Getting all of my stuff ready on the table, ready to go so I can get eating. So the rice wraps, you gotta put in water beforehand, so you let that soak. And then when it's done soaking, you can take it out, and it comes on into this texture, and you put it on the wood board. Then you just fill it. Fill it with whatever you want. You can do whatever you want with this. I've put pickles, I've put even feta. I know that's kind of random, but I just love the vinegary taste in it. So you just wrap it up. I'm not an expert, so please don't judge. So good. And then dip, dip, dip. Now we're into snack time. Oh yay, snack time is another favorite. Okay, so I gotta get my chamomile to need some de-stressing in my life. And then I make these energy balls, it's just chocolate and peanut butter and some gluten-free oatmeal. Some popcorners because yum. Okay, so then we're into dinner time. So I did the garlic and now I put it in with some chickpeas, put it in the microwave for a little. Meanwhile, we're gonna be making tahini. So we're making tahini for the hummus so that you can make the hummus. And then the hummus is gonna be for the falafel to go with it. So right now I'm making the tahini and that's gonna be super tasty. So there we go, we add that to the chickpeas that we just heated up in the microwave. A little bit of lemon juice, olive oil, and away we go. Boom, 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 look at that. 
Then we're gonna make the falafel. So we're adding all the ingredients, parsley, dill, garlic, onions. I added chalice instead of onions, tasty still. And we just gotta wait and let it mix. Once it's mixed, you put it in a bowl so that you can scoop it out easily. This takes the longest time because they're a weird texture. So just roll them into a ball. Then I'm gonna cut all the veggies up because that's gonna go on my plate. I'm not having any bread with mine. So I'm just gonna have like a falafel plate. And there you go. Everything is out, ready to go. And this was a delicious, fresh, tasty meal. And I definitely will be making it again. I have some quinoa, hummus, and falafels. Thanks for watching what I eat in a day.